If you want to continue uh, understanding more special data types, another one that we come across is called neighbor. So uh, this never data type is pretty interesting if I write, you know, latex of type never. It's not really of a lot of use uh, at this place because I can't write x equal to anything in that case. Uh, x equal to 1 would not be allowed because 1 is not a data type never. Uh, I can, uh, you know, not even uh, allocate undefined to it or I cannot even uh, define null to it. So even uh, undefined and null are not never. So what is the use case of never? Uh, so to understand that we will actually have to uh, create a function. So if I create a function, uh, you know, and I call this function as, uh, you know, greet and uh, it takes, uh, let's say a name and uh, what it does is it uh, does uh, console.log, uh, you know, uh, hello uh, plus name. So uh, with functions also, we need to define the data types of the parameters as well as the return type of the function. So the data type of the parameter is defined here like this. So now I have said that uh, the name variable is going to be of type string and then I can call basically greet with uh, something like, you know, uh, uh, Arnav. And if this is the code that I ran, then, uh, you know, we can go to our console and see that, you know, hello Arnav uh, was printed. Um, if I return uh, 10 here, okay, so uh, that is also possible uh, and if uh, I do return 10, I mean as of right now it does not make a difference but if I did something like, you know, uh, let x equal to greet, then it matters what it returns because that would be the data type of x. So if I want to make sure that this function does not return anything at all, that is where having a never return type is uh, very useful. So this is how you define the data type of, uh, you know, uh, the, uh, you know, uh, function okay now when you have a never return type uh, that means that your function should not actually end to a return statement which means that if you have a function that uh, I don't know uh, let's say throw new error uh, you know uh, so if you have a function which always throws an error uh, this function uh, is not able to return in any case okay so if you if you you know uh, run this code you will get this error uncaught error uh, some in, inside the greet function so basically uh, you know uh, a function which should never end uh, that's where the never data type is very important now that's in practical use case something that we don't use uh, too often most most of the times your function throws an error only if there is a problem but otherwise it's do, otherwise it does uh, go to the end of the execution but uh, still if you want to have a kind of a function which should never end at the uh, you know uh, should never go to the return statement because even if you don't have any line uh, then also your function is actually uh, doing this okay uh, so if you don't define anything then return undefined is what a function basically does because uh, you can uh, see that happen uh, if i don't have it at never okay and uh, if i do uh, sorry uh, console.log type of x if i do you will see that you know the uh, and if i don't write the return undefined line uh, then also it's undefined right so uh, not uh, not returning anything on a function is equivalent of doing return undefined but if you uh, set your uh, function to have a never return type that means your function should never actually reach the return line at all so that's what the never data type does